My name is Candy Redder. I am a volunteer. I volunteer in uh, uh, working on trails, kitchen, mainly chimp care, and, um, and tours, and wherever else they need me. And I've been volunteering since January of 2019. Depending on what um, task you're volunteering for, most of, like chimp care, usually I like to be here at 8.15, so I usually arrive at the gatehouse like five after, 10 after eight. Sign in, yell over the, sign in on the paper, on the log sheet, over radio in that I'm entering the um, site. And uh, they'll usually let you know which um, villa or chateau you'll be working in. And then I just start, doing the volunteer work that I'm set to do there. And now mainly, like I said, I'm doing chimp care. If it's a matter of a tour, you just arrive about, I arrived about a half an hour before the tour is supposed to start. Make sure, you know, guests are greeted, start the tour at the right time. And that usually takes about an hour. And, um, you know, everything's pretty well written out as far as what your duties are and, you know, how long it'll take. Chimp care sometimes runs later because they're not that cooperative, but um, usually it's about four, four or five hours of you know pretty good work. I enjoy one. I you know of course I love the chimps. They are special creatures. Uh, the people that work here are wonderful, and that's what keeps me coming back. Also, they're appreciative. They're caring. It's kind of nice being, I'm retired and it's kind of nice spending, you know, half, most of the day with younger people. And, um, you know, they're just a really good group of people. The administration is good here. Our support is good. So, you know, between the chimps and the people who are working here that, that are caring, I, you know, I just enjoy it. It's like my happy place. I mean, when. COVID hit, I put a lot of hours on in because there was like nothing else that you could do and they needed help. And, you know, that's basically, basically what keeps me coming back, just helping these chimps and the people that take care of them. Cause you know, the chimps have really sacrificed a lot in their life. I'll tell, oh, there was one that was funny. Um, Ariel, she was our youngest one in Chimps Ahoy. And they had just really introduced the girls and the boys. And she's like the bratty little girl. And she was with a group of, she was on the porch and I was outside the porch. And she was with a group of, um, of the girls and the boys were like right next to them. And she jumped out of the group of girls, calls off and punches, I mean, full out punches one of the boys. And with that, she was like, had that uh-oh moment and jumps back into the group of girls and starts screaming. I mean, you know, like a typical bratty little sister. So of course, Lindsay, who's the um, matriarch there, she's the alpha of the, of the girls and she's wonderful. She calmed the situation down before the boys could get her. So it's always, you know, it's always something with them. They're, they're very much like us. You, I get a kick out of watching them interact. They're, you know, they have they have special friends, and you know they're just wonderful beings. And I guess that's what keeps me coming back too, because I just want them to have, you know, help out and so they can have their best life.